With a plane, go ahead and subdivide it and increase the number of cuts to six. Go ahead and inset these vertices and then X and delete faces. Alt left click the loop, Alt shift S and one. Then right click smooth vertices, increase the repeat to five. Then Alt shift S and one again and scale it down a little bit. In front view, extrude on the Z axis, scale it down, E to extrude, S to scale, and then E, Z and extrude it down. Control R, add a loop cut up here, and add another one up here. Add a loop cut down here, Alt left click this edge twice, E, Z and extrude it down. Right click, shade smooth, and Control 2. Out of the base color, get a separate X, Y, Z set to Z, and Control T. Plug the vector into vector, and change this to generated. Add a color ramp after the separate X, Y, Z, change it to constant, adjust the slide Sliders, control left click to add new sliders and give it this kind of look right here add another color ramp after this one change the black color to an orange color add a noise texture plug the vector into vector add a color ramp after the noise bring the black slider up and the white slider down on the noise detail to 15 and roughness up a little bit drop a mix color after the orange color ramp plug the black and white color ramp into the factor bring slot B to a dark gray color plug this color ramp into the roughness and change the black color to a light gray color Adjust as needed. Out of the normal, get a bump node. Plug the gray and white color ramp into the height. Distance to 0 0.003. Subsurface weight to 1. And increase the scale to 0.4 or so. And boom, we got a traffic cone.